certainly one of the top five items I'm asked to coach people on has to do with productivity. So I thought I'd develop a list that might be of use. Number one, schedule your work, not just your appointments. What that means is take a look at all of those things that are not necessarily highly urgent, those projects that take time to do, and break them into smaller bite-sized time increments, the two hours, the three hours, what have you, and put them into your calendar as appointments to yourself. The idea here is if it's not in your calendar, it's probably not a commitment. Number two, plan time to plan. Take the 15 minutes, the half an hour, once a week, take a look at your calendar, your commitments, and make adjustments, move things around as you see fit. Number three, focus only on those high priority items. Get away from those busybody things that necessarily are not important, but they're really, really urgent. See if you can delegate them or get them off your calendar. Which brings me to number four, Say no more often. What I've found is that more successful people get in their careers, the more they get noticed by leadership and the more leadership wants part of their time. So therefore, it's very important to know how to be able to say no delicately and effectively so you're not taking on more than you possibly can. Number five, as Tony Schwartz talks about in his book, The Power of Full Engagement, those of us who can develop rituals to be able to keep our energy high and consistently so are far more productive than those that are lethargic and tired. And last but not least, let's see if we can break the urgency addiction. Let's see if we can actually have a different mindset about what it means to be successful so that we don't equate success with being stressed out and frenetic. Yes, it's very important to have time with family and friends and a work-life balance and all those things that we find that are meaningful and that create meaning in our life. Those are personal items, but they're also items for business because they make us a lot more productive.